Sal, thanks very much. Well, Amit Pau is the managing director of the investment firm Ariadne Capital. Amit, good morning. Welcome. Um, Sally ran through the numbers there, and what stands out to us is that growth in mobile. And it's mobile that they've done so well with, coming from well, a base where they had no mobile strategy whatsoever. Absolutely, Ben. Firstly, thank you for having me back. Stunning, stellar, spectacular results. And if we put it into context, four years ago when they did their IPO, there was zero mobile strategy. In fact, you know, Mark Zuckerberg uh, on the IPO documentation put that as a risk warning flag. Mm. Despite that, in four years, they have just grown and really become a mobile first business. So 84% of their revenue, when you put it into the context, as Sally mentioned, on a quarter of 7 billion revenue, they clearly have smashed those results. Those positive contexts needs to put into some of the concerns that could be going forward, which is the slowdown in mobile advertising growth potential. And I think that needs to be put into context of two or three specific issues. First is them not alienating the consumer by over, over advertising. Yeah, and that's their admission, isn't it, that they can only put so many adverts on someone's feed before they think, look, there's too much and I'm going to switch off. Absolutely. So one is just overload, alienating one. The second one, which is all around the privacy issue, which, you know, Europe has been very, very vocal in leading the world. And the third one, which we've discussed before on Business Live, is Ariadne feel that the consumer is the own, owner of their data. Mm. So there's this three-way tug of war between Facebook, the digital publishers, the brands and the consumer on who owns the data. Well, and the privacy a big issue because yesterday in the UK, one of the biggest insurers here said initially there was a report that they were going to start trawling Facebook feeds to work out how conscientious, how safe uh, drivers potentially were and they'd calculate their insurance premium as a result. Facebook very quick to clamp down and say, look, they're not going to have access to that data. But it's a real issue. We're putting this information out there. Businesses want to use it. Absolutely. So clearly, I think Facebook should be commended on the actions they took yesterday. Businesses do want to use the data and what they should be doing it is in a responsible, social, considered way. At Ariadne, we're fortunate to invest in a company called Autograph. And Autograph really empowers consumers to take control of their data, monetize their data, but in particular allow brands to use that in a meaningful way so they engage. So that is really going to be one of the biggest trends going forward. Mm. Well, we'll watch closely. Amit, thanks very much for all Thank of that. You. Amit Powell there from Ariadne Capital. Thank you.